All right, guys and girls, it's Jernigan here, boys and girls. I'm charging my phone, as you can see. The power's gone again. Annoying, I know. We've all had that feeling with phones before. Pardon me. What annoys me in this world, I don't know if it annoys you guys, boys and girls, and ladies and gentlemen. Why don't they hire more police or more people that like to answer calls on the phone and put them in the police service in the UK, Northern Ireland, Scotland and Wales? Like, temporary people, they don't have to be policemen or anything. But they're like police staff. Why don't you put more police staff into places with phones, and they can answer people's phone calls? Someone could be dying. Someone could be getting stabbed. Someone could be getting shot, and the police can't got the resources to answer the phone. And unfortunately, some people die, uh, especially for 101 in Telford. Shifnal has different numbers. So does Manchester for extra police. You may call a different number in Manchester or across the UK, Northern Ireland, Scotland, Wales got different numbers. Plus 999 is the main number. Why don't you put more resources in there? People to answer the phone. Same with the hospital staff as well. Why don't they get more resources to answer the hospital phones and uh, mental hospital phones and fire service phones and... Uh, oh, God, it just blows your head in. I'm sure you guys with a good reading, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. More people in the council that answer your phones when you need to get your money sorted or, you know, if you want to get a job. Answer more phones for people, then more people will be more willing to do things and get out there and do stuff. The whole world's a mess. Some people are ill, lots of us are poorly. And, uh, you know, we I would have thought we had a good Prime Minister, but obviously he's just stupid and a waste of time. But Richie should not get in to be Prime Minister and get 30 more police officers on the streets. Uh, Theresa May demolished the police, that's why they all left. If you want to be a security guard, put more people on the phone for that as well. You want to join the army more people on the phone you know what i mean people need to be on the phone more to answer your calls there's not enough resources same with college as well and going to schools be on the phone you know swimming baths i don't know um sports sensors you know all these things but the rather us people struggle and get there and take more money off us the rich don't pay anything the poor the poor pay more it's like a, like a dog, eat, dog eating world, be eaten, as some people would say and agree. True. But the thing is, in this world, it's just going crazy. Sports cars going up and down the road, the police can't do anything about it. Noise from neighbours, the police don't want to get involved and call the council. The council got them. Yeah, the other thing as well, the council need more people. Volunteers, for example. All these things they could be doing and helping us all. But some people don't want to do anything or choose not to or don't want to or don't know how to you want people to go in that right direction and help us but have you been struggled and brought up yourself and you can't even help us because you've had a rough life yourself you politicians and people that are on conservative and labor yeah i'm watching this interesting guy on youtube he's called a different bless he talks about um how the world's going he's an interesting guy as you can see there and how the government is the government is just going downhill in my opinion and uh, if you do see this video, or do like your videos, you can watch his videos on Twitter, it's called Phil, uh, More House 76 I watch a few of his videos and what is going on with Parliament, what is going on with Lord, House of Lords, what is going on across the world really. World War 3 soon, fears of that, well, we'll get more people in the army, we'll get attacked, we'll have more armed police protecting our country or normal police. Well, all the police carry guns like France and Germany and Italy and Spain and... America, all these ideas, but anyway, I thought I'd do a quick video, hope you all enjoyed it, and uh, I better go, take it easy, peace, see you later.